political leader, the next Prime Minister of Grenada, Karakon P.D. Martinique, Deacon Mitchell, members of the St. David's NDC constituency branch, and to the people of Vincent, Champlain, Dodma, Child Island, Providence, Sarah Cruz, Windsor Forest, a special good evening to you all. I stand here tonight not as a stranger to this community, not as a stranger to the people of this community. I stand here tonight as a friend, as a brother, as someone who have roamed this community playing football, basketball, and just socializing with the people. I stand here tonight to endorse Brother Deacon Mitchell as the next member of parliament for St. David. On the 23rd of this month, I mean next month, first I won the election to call fast. On the 23rd of next month, we are called to make a very important decision. A decision that will determine the future of our country. A, de a decision that will determine the quality of life the standard of living that the people of this community enjoy. My friends, for far too long, the people of St. David's have been crying out for proper representation. For far too long, the people of St. David's have been crying out for proper housing. For far too long, the young people of Vincent's the young people of Windsor Forest, the young people of Champlain, the young people of Dodma, Sarah Cruz, have been crying out for opportunities to improve their quality of life. They have been crying out for community centers. They have been crying out for improved sporting facilities. They have been crying out for skills training centers to develop themselves so that they can have a fierce chance at realizing their dreams. My friends, those cries have been ignored over the years. But I can assure you, Deacon has listened to your cry. He has walked this community on Saturday. He has listened to your concerns. He has listened to your challenges. And he has listened to the pain of the people. And I am guaranteeing my friend, once elected to serve you, he will respond to those cries. To the people of St. David, you can find in Deacon a leader. Not just an ordinary leader that will jump and dance and whine, but a leader that would lead with compassion. A leader that would lead with empathy. A leader that would listen to the cries and the concerns of the people and address those concerns. My friends, I am very concerned about the direction of our country. I have traveled this country over the years, serving as the former CARICOM Youth Ambassador for Grenada. I have listened to the concerns of young people. They have been trapped in a cycle of poverty. And they won't escape that bondage. I say to the young people here tonight, those who are under the Imani program, those who are depending on the safety net programs, there's a better future. There's greater possibilities. Yes, yes, yes. You are more than just an Imani worker. You are more than just citizens that are just eating the scripts. You deserve to sit at the table. You deserve to enjoy a good meal. You deserve good quality education. You deserve proper health care services. And you deserve a good retirement. 
My friends, out of this dark political night, a bright day will emerge. Once you elect Deacon Mitchell and the NDC to serve you, Grenada will transform. We will prosper and we will go to new heights of economic development and prosperity. My friends, I am excited. I am optimistic because I know on the 23rd of June, the people of St. David, the people of Grenada, the people of Karakou and Pini Matni will send a very strong message to the NMP that change is going to come because we believe in Grenada and we believe in a better future for our country. My friends, are you ready for change? Are you fired up for change? Say change is coming. And change is going to come. Once we go out on election day, once we go out early, once we make sure that our friends, our family, our colleagues are charged up on that day and they'll go out early to vote. My friends, we have to stay focused. There's a lot of distractions. They will sell out a lot of propaganda. My friend, but we have to stay focused because we have a country to build. Our country has found itself in a very, very dark place. But we are going to get out of that dark place together. We are going to get out of that dark place with B Deacon Mitchell as our Prime Minister and the NDC forming the next government. So my friends, go back to your communities. Go back to your homes. Go back to your workplace. Encourage your colleagues. And let them know that a brighter day for Grenada is possible with Deacon Mitchell as our Prime Minister and the NDC as the next government. Thank you, my friends. Thank you. Thank you. May God bless each one of you here tonight.